It's not hard to live right. It's a choice to live right. And you can only do that when you truly dedicate yourself to the Lord Jesus Christ. Repentance means that I renounce, I reject, I understand that I am a sinner and I need saving. And I can't save myself. I need Jesus. So I'm truly sorry for my sins because I realize I'm a mess. And that without Jesus, I am hell bound. That means everything in my life, it doesn't matter what I think, what I feel, what I think I know, what I was taught, what I learned. If it's not what Jesus said, it's all wrong. You can't argue with the Bible. You're wasting your time. You argue with man and you think you and you don't know you're arguing with God. However, every person must be born again of the spirit and the water. What but Jesus is God come in the flesh. God is a spirit. When Jesus was on the cross, both blood and water pulled out of him. That is what you have to be born again in. Water baptism does not save you. Do we get baptized? Yes. But that's not the salvation. Jesus is the salvation. He is the water and the spirit. That's why it came out of his body. You, we're baptized into Jesus Christ. We're baptized in the name of Jesus Christ for the repentance and remission of our sins. Not into religion. God has nothing to do with religion. Religion will not be in heaven. God is not coming back for, for Episcopal, Baptist, Methodist, Muslim, uh, first day, uh, seventh day Adventist, or um, um, Hindu, or Buddhism, or any other of those things. He's coming back for those that belong to Him, those that follow Him with all their heart, who've put their trust only in Him. Jesus is the only way because He is God. You can argue, you can run, you can hide, you're wasting your time. Just. Simply surrender. It's not hard to live right when you understand that it's simple. Just like you go to your job, just like you want your kids to obey you, just like you want your spouse to, to respect you and love you. That's what God wants. He just wants you to choose to love Him and understand that His way is perfect. And if you follow what He's telling you, your life is, is right. That's why he said, my will be done on earth as it is in heaven. He wants us to live the life we were intended to live here as we would in heaven. 